In this tutorial we shall build a teapot. Let us use a polyline to create the lower part of the teapot's profile. Use the Rhino commands directly. Rhino parametrics will interpret them and create a parametric object. Once the polyline created, let us edit it and add a fillet to its definition. The preview updates in the Rhino views. Create the upper part of the profile using a B-spline. Use the last point of the polyline as the first point of the B-spline. Using standard Rhino commands, you can continue working as always. Zoom in, zoom out, move the views during the creation process of parametric objects, etc. Here it is then. The B-spline has been created. Now merge the two portions of the profile into a single parametric object. Use the merge command and select the two profile curves. The merge object is now created. Hide the reference objects for better visibility. Hide the B-spline and the polygon. We'll now revolve the profile. still using standard Rhino commands. Rhino Parametrics interprets the commands and creates the parametric object. Select the objects. And here it is. Now we'll create the spout of the teapot. Use a B-spline to draw the spout's center line. Done. Using Rhino Parametrics, we'll now create the tube. Select the B-spline as the center line and specify the radii. The preview updates in the Rhino views and we can easily change the spouse radii to obtain the desired results. This model will be completed in another tutorial after a good beginning for the teapot.